Second Life is my main income. Anyone can create anything. That's the whole draw for me. People who have no idea that they are creative come into Second Life and find out that they can make things. So, Zach, you are the king of magic in Second Life. My character was going to be a wizard. And I started making spells for him to use. You're not limited in what you're allowed to do. You can do nearly anything. I make dresses that are rather difficult to make in physical reality. We raise funds to feed children in Kenya. I am the creator of the Mr. Bones machine. We have a band in Second Life and it's called Engrama. I use Second Life for virtual time travel. We recreated Berlin during the 1920s. You can learn a lot about the Weimar Republic era by reliving it. This is a National Science Foundation educational grant. The avatar represents who I really feel inside. Created in real life, this art takes its own personality in Second Life. Our focus really has been on Second Life just because there's so much fun stuff that we can make. I had to keep creating. I can't not create. When I first heard about Second Life, that was the fit for my project because of how immersive it is. To see it progress from the raw idea to completion is just a, a fantastic experience. I don't think that that magic ever disappears. Mm -hmm.